Well, Black Forest fire victims are figuring out how to get their voting registration sorted out before it's too late. The election for the Black Forest Fire Board is just a little more than a month away. And it's a story we broke last night on KRDA News Channel 13 at 10 o'clock. The El Paso County Clerk and Recorder says some Black Forest residents may have inadvertently disqualified themselves from voting. KRDA News Channel 13's Olivia Wilmson checked with homeowners to see what they're doing to get their voices heard. Next month's Black Forest Fire Board election is mail and ballot only. Everybody needs to be aware that they're not just going to send it to any address. It has to be an address in the forest. Anthony David says he always votes when he can. He and less than 200 others cast a ballot in the last election. But this year, David says his vote matters more after he lost his home in the Black Forest Fire last summer. It's a big deal, this election, especially because we're trying to get. So a lot of people have lost confidence in, in, in the fire board or the fire department the way it's being run right now. New election laws now say ballots can't be forwarded to new addresses like other mail. I absolutely have to um, figure it out because voting is very important to me, especially on the issue, you know, issues that are at hand. Seven candidates are running for three positions on the fire board. They're dictating policy. I want to make sure that they understand what uh, what can happen in a wildfire and what they need to do to get in front of it. There are two options to make sure you receive a mail-in ballot. Hop online or visit one of the clerk and recorder offices. Your residential address has to be in Black Forest. Your mailing address can be your temporary home. If everybody can get the message out that everybody needs to check and make sure their vote can count, then we can be rest assured that the community has a voice. In Black Forest, Olivia Wilmson, KRDO News Channel 13. And you have until April 14th to register. We have posted voting information and a link to change your address on KRDO.com. Well,